Hello Snooker fans, welcome to Snooker Pro Club YouTube channel. I'm Vidrushu Debert, a BC Snooker coach and player. In this Snooker practice video, 8 reds and 8 blues, I will share my thoughts on shot selection, cue ball spin, cue ball speed and cue action. Let's begin. At the beginning of this practice routine, you can put a cue ball wherever you want. I recommend you to start with the 4th red from the right side for the right hand player and the opposite side for the left hand player. This shot I play with the little right hand side below the cue ball center. Right hand side helped me to make good position of play for the next blue ball. I also play with the free cushion speed. One big tip, try to play all shots as smooth as possible. Smooth, long and accelerating backswing will cause good cue ball timing and straight cue delivery. It allows controlling the cue ball better than during the jerky, fast and hard cue action. The second shot I played below the cue ball center. Take a soft screw shot smoothly delivering with one cushion speed. In case somebody wonders why do I play the shot with a bit left hand side, the answer is pretty simple. It ensures better potting and cubo control. Why cubo control? Because cubo rolls better with the little side spin, so I can use less cubo power. It may be tricky for the beginner snooker players, but for intermediate or advanced players, the shot wouldn't be a problem. Simple roll up shot, slightly higher than cue ball center. Play with one cushion speed with short controlled backswing. Fifth shot is difficult, because for the right hand player it is harder to reach the shot, even when you are quite tall like me. I also need to backspin a ball and execute 3.5 cushion speed. My tip is to try being as comfortable as possible with your body, otherwise use mini butt or rest. Now play the shot softly a bit below the cue ball center with 1.25 cushion speed. I made poor positional shot for the 7 red ball, having only tiny angle to make position for the next blue ball. So I will play power shot and create more angle. Aim a bit below cubo center and play it with 4 cushion speed. I have to play long blue to corner pocket, because it is easier to control cue ball and make position for the reds than to play blue ball into the middle pocket. Play it slightly below the cue ball center with 2.5 cushion speed. My tip is to remember that the thinner potting angle, the harder cue ball will control. In the second part, 8 reds, 8 blues practice routine, you will see some difficult positional shots and finally, total clearance. 
subscribe to our Snooker Pro Club YouTube channel.